J. Cool. Mother Africa, Mother Africa, come on, Mother Africa, I'm coming home. Welcome to Coop's Corner. Come along for the journey. It's a lifestyle, and it's all about learning. I love you, Africa. Hi, you. What's going on, guys? It's your man J. Coop, and we are at Nairobi. Street Kitchen. This is my friend right here, Miss Kadini. Say hi. Hello. Are you ready to eat right now? Absolutely. She is, guys. Like, she's like a little hangry. Like, I'm not gonna lie, but we're about to have some fun. I want to show you guys the place because the place is dope. The freaking graffiti is amazing. And, like, it's like a lot of different places you can eat here. Oh. And drink. Oh, God. Okay. Like, drink. All right, guys. So, we're about to show you all the food you can eat here. Let's get into it. Hey. Okay, guys. So, we got fire and dough pizza. Are you feeling pizza right now? Me either, man. Like, the place looks good, though, so. Can y'all see what that says behind us? I licked it so it's mine. That, listen, man, that's like kind of crazy. So. How's it going? What do you serve here? Huh? Mexican margaritas. Thank you, this video, Kenya. But it's my I don't drink, but she might have to stop by over here. He has the drinks here. Oh. oh, I shouldn't have told her that. I don't know why I told her that. Why did I? Crazy. Oh, shit. Here we go. Why are we doing this? What are we doing here, people? It's just the alcohol, which is dangerous, baby. But it's really good. It's really good. Eight out of ten. Eight out of ten? Eight out of ten for the Africa. <laughs> I swear to take What is this called? What do you have? Mangorita. Mangorita. So it's a margarita, but made out of mango. What about the mango taste? Can you taste it? Yes, absolutely. Mmm. She about to be twisted. So yes guys, Nairobi Street Kitchen is very lit. I hope that I'm able to show you enough while I'm in here of the actual establishment. It's very big. You have seven restaurants inside this one compound. And it's very hip, it's very dope. You can get ice cream, you can get Mexican food, you can get burgers. And I think we're going to get some burgers right now, guys. So let's fill up our stomachs and let's see what it's tasting like, baby. It's a beautiful day to be alive. Ay! What do you want right now? What are you about Burgers. to get? Burger, okay. It's gonna be messy. Show hey. them which one. Okay, I'm okay. Interestingly, <laughs> have you noticed the potato buds? They're not red buds. Oh, Ooh. nah, man. No. Hold on, so like, why? So hold on. <laughs> we can be so we need to ask if there's gonna be, it's like gonna be like mush, mushy. Right. I'm looking at the bacon or the brief briskets. Mmm. chicken looks good, but nah. Meat. Burgers. <laughs> yeah, but so they don't have fries. Hold they on, they don't have fries. Hold up. <laughs> burgers, right? But it's interesting burgers. They put burgers don't come with the side guys. <laughs> they just come as burgers as they are. For that price point, first of all. Second of all, they only have fancy fries. You know, loaded fries. Which is... This ain't it, y'all. Yeah. So we're gonna keep looking. Yeah. Let's go, guys. <laughs> It's an ice cream place. Ice cream. Yeah. Okay. About to take the bus. Thanks, man. We are following a drunk, crazy kitty alert. This is amazing, man. This is amazing. This is like the greatest vlog in life. Yeah, this is like <laughs> Let's go! Hit that like button, guys. We're having fun. Guys, check out the bus, man. Really on a bus right now, okay? 360 view. Hey, so what's the menu? What are we looking at? This is vegetarian. Oh. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Hold on. We have paneer, which is awesome. Cheese. Yeah. What is this menu again? Vegetarian. <laughs> this is a vegetarian place, right? Nope. We both said no to this. So like, what is the next stop to look? chicken place. We said no to pizza, right? Yeah. We said no to bagas. Nope. And it's time we gotta go to the chicken spot. Let's go. Okay, guys, so here's the noodle space. Look at the beautiful artwork, though, that you'll see. That's the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> Got it! <laughs> Got it! I wanna try the smoked shrimp ribs. Oh, this actually might make me feel better because I'm like coughing. <laughs> Three minutes, wow. So like, do you think this is gonna be good though? To be honest, I watched some of the reviews. People say the cocktails are long, the food is 
Oh, really? But to see that's the truth of that. We got two totally different things from this place, <laughs> yeah. right? But so, so we have to break these open and see what's what. Smells like samosa. Okay, let's see how we're. Looks like samosa. Is it good? It tastes like like the samosas from Sanford. I'll say. If you know, you know. Sanford samosa. So that's not good. What are the prices? But that's good. This is good. All right, let's see what it's what it's hitting for. I don't understand. Why is this place called noodles? Like, <laughs> that's true. None of this is noodles. <laughs> I thought this was gonna be short ribs because it says smoked short ribs. Okay. <laughs> Give me that samosa before, right? Mm-hmm. Doesn't it taste almost the same? The samosa that I had was better than that. Oh. And it was off the street. That's a bad deal. <laughs> Yo, news. What? Like, what is this? He says that he eats another one. He's like, what is this? God, I'm, <laughs> I'm hungry, man. This one got no taste. The chicken, right? <laughs> what is this? This is the most point. <laughs> now like look, the ones that she ordered are somewhat good. This is like eating air. Like you can't even taste anything on this, guys. So one, two, three, four, your starters. And then yeah, here's where now the nude starts. Yeah. So you gotta give an honest review. What do you rate this? I give the chicken one out of ten. Four. Four point and five. Because it's slightly better taste. And the yeah. well wing, all in all. Okay. She's nicer than me. <laughs> All right, so time to get real. I'm like, I hope somebody from Nairobi Street Kitchen watches this. The chicken one, right? This one right here, this is a zero, okay? The beef, I give it like a six. I give it a six because it's like the chicken has like no taste to it at all. But this one, it's okay. I like it. Like, it's like, you know what I mean? So honestly, Street Kitchen, we should get a refund for the chicken. <laughs> you gave the cocktail an eight out of 10, didn't you? Eight out of 10. Maybe if I take too much, I'm trying to a nine. Oh, she <laughs> y'all let's get it bird exchange are you ready to try this oh god okay guys let's see what we're getting like do you have any allergies so far just from this menu what are you seeing that you like single hobo fries have you ever eaten that <laughs> the american people <laughs> this is like arrowroot arrowroot fries so that's different to me like it really depends on what type of sauce they have you should ask what Korean fried chicken. Mm. The kimchi too. That's oh, so we're served with chicken. buffalo sauce. So this is probably like dessert, guys. So we have the spilt milk section right here. That actually looks kind of crazy. Look at that sandwich. Uh, no, but no, look at look at that. It looks like a bagel. Oh, it is, it a, is a bagel. bagel. Smoked trout bagel. Yo. Plain croissant. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. Nope. Yeah. If you want to take anything here, take the macarons. Because you can never go wrong with them. It's a different menu. Yeah. Different. I like the ambiance though. Look at this. Cafe meets Mama Rock. Right? They have a library too, guys. Okay, guys, that was Nairobi Street Kitchen. Now, we're gonna let the lady tell us how she felt about it first. Break it down, Miss KD. Okay, ambience, A1. Yeah, if you came with like 10 outfits, you would look like you're in 10 different places. If you're coming for pictures, this is the spot. The cocktails, I only had one, so. Cocktails were good. Again, an eight. It was a nice cocktail. But the food, wameangu kam tikadi. Okay. <laughs> but we went to like all the places and couldn't find something to eat. And even the one place that we did try, only one of the food was good. All right, so the ambiance, very dope. I can see why people want to come here to take pictures. Let's get straight to the food. <laughs> The food was trash. The people were very nice though. That's true, the staff. The staff was Everyone very was nice. Them. So that takes it up like a notch for me. But the food, it was not popping. So, Nairobi Street Kitchen. Less hype, put more hype in your food. Food! Because that's what you're coming for, by the way. It's not just to look cute. Work on the food, but the ambiance is a 10 out of 10. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Like, subscribe, leave a comment in the comment section. And, you know what we gotta say, right? No. <laughs> Alright, y'all, until next time. Bye. Peace. Welcome to Coop's Corner. Come along for the journey. It's a lifestyle and it's all about learning.